tow rig. Look no further than this Cadillac Escalade. It's a 2009 Escalade ESV. Is the luxury edition. Has the power running boards and all that stuff. And we got us 16 foot car trailer right here. Mm -hmm. Got a fancy old uh, hard freight winch right there. 5,000 pounds. Yes, sir. And to top it off, we even got the wireless edition. Talk about ultimate tow rig for a red net. Right there it is, boys. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you find yourself in a situation where you have to let the winch out because you, your gear broke down. Put her on free spool there, Junior. But if your handy dandy years broke down, look no further as winch got you. We gonna pull her in neutral right there. We gonna get her our Harbor Freight wireless remote and we gonna push the button and it's gonna pull us on in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Here we go, boys. That's how you do it right there, boys. You load it right there up on the trailer. Mm -hmm. Got that old yeeter winch. We yeet that little reader, yeeter sucker right up on our trailer. Mm -hmm. All right, then. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Please. Anyways, guys, I hope you, you got a kick out of that skit. In all seriousness, those guys, the Escalade does a fantastic job towing a 6.2 all-wheel drive. This is my trailer that I tow on. It's a 16 foot. I bought it brand new. I think I've had it in 13 different states now. And uh, I do have a Harbor Freight 5,000 pound winch on there. And as you can see in my little skit there, it does pull pretty good. It does it does really well. I, I buy a bunch of cars that are broke down and it hasn't let me down yet. I bought this uh, a two inch uh, tubing at like my local supply. Uh, metal supply place and I uh, just cut it up and weld it onto the tongue here And then I got these uh, D-rings from Harbor Freight and weld them on there be able to strap cars down pretty good um, It is wired to the truck As you can see right here This right here is uh, like a winch quick disconnect and uh, it's wired all the way to the battery of the truck So that I never have to worry about having power for the winch and then I did the upgrade for the uh wireless controller and it's mounted under the deck of the trailer and if I wanted to use my wired controller you could just unplug the uh, wireless controller here and plug your wired controller in there I really like the, uh, the wireless remote it's a great option you can sit in the car and steer it up onto the trailer and I think it has a 50 foot range which is the, the winch has a 50 foot of cable on it um, the wired remote has about 15 feet so, I mean, you could like stand back here and use your wired remote and uh, use it to winch up on there. But the wireless remote, definitely worth extra money if you want uh, to splurge your extra $30 and get your uh, wireless remote for your Harbor Freight winch. And like I said, if everything I, I do is mostly Hondas and it hasn't let me down yet. Uh, yeah, this old trailer, I put it through some, through some stuff. I've had a had an accident where I, I clipped the Mercedes with the fender right here and I uh, just took a hammer and bent it back out and it actually bent both of the bent both of these wheels didn't bust the tires the same tires that were on it uh, but I had to replace the steel wheels um, same fender that was on it when I when I clipped the Mercedes I barely barely clipped it but I clipped it um, I did some little upgrades to my trailer put like LED lights on it and whatnot uh, been a great trailer. Came from uh, Cotter Trailers up in, uh, I think they're in Tennessee. That's where I bought it. So, been a pretty good one. The only really issue I've ever had out of it was tires. This comes with six ply tires. Uh, and so, 
fronts are still six ply the back on both sides is eight ply and I haven't had any issues with the eight ply tires so if you buy one of these little car hauler trailers that's on the lower end side I would, I would definitely recommend doing the, some eight ply tires so anyways guys I appreciate you tuning in I hope you got a kick out of my, my little skit I did there and uh, yeah thanks for tuning in See you next time. Peace. Look at that fine marsupial drinking that beverage.